Merry Christmas! It Christmas! Merry Christmas! Merry Chrysler! <laughs> Hello guys, it's RD Prayer right here, and my name is Prayer. Uh, well, quick introduction. I am that artist, and you don't exactly have to know me, but just my own. I am gonna throw bunches of art and craft right here in my channel, so be prepared. Today, we are going to make an explosion box, but in a Christmas version, and don't waste any time here. Okay, let's go, let's go, let's go! Before we begin, please hit like, subscribe, and share it if you like it. Okay, so first of all, I'm gonna show you what is an explosion box. Many people know, but some don't. It's a box with granny. It's a box with boom. A lot of surprise. Well, actually, it is a box with several layers with tricks, messages, snack, or whatever your creativity tell you to do. Sometimes when occasion come, whether it's birthday, anniversary, or even Christmas, we usually look for a gift, right? But year after year pass, and you realize that I don't know what to give to him or her or the loved one. So, that's the time that handmade comes to shy and it is one and only pieces craft from love. If you have time to try it for once, it wouldn't be that easy, but not that hard too. The people who got this will really feel your efforts. So here, let's begin. I am gonna make a miniature door outside with a Christmas tree in the center and the rest will be messages, my art, picture, and sweets. And the outside will be a house. And as you can see the components and the other things here, I'm gonna break down what do we need to prepare. First, four pieces of a bit thick paper in any color that you decide, depend on how many layers of the box you want to make. Mine are yellow, red, green, and another black. You could use a two-sided color paper in the shop nearby though. Well, my version is gonna be a bit messy as I meant to make it different for the inside and the outside. So if you wanna make something like mine, just follow. I also plan to make a brick wall outside too. So we are gonna need a cardboard box left over from um, this video. Who haven't checked it out, please do so. Second is glue. It could be hot glue, super glue, two sided tape or anything, but please make sure that it can glue your paper together and not leak out or show any dirty mark. Next, scissor and cutter. Last one, the decorative item. It could be anything. Um, for me, it's gonna be some sweets, some acrylic, some oil pastel, and a rope. Now let's begin. We are going to need four layers of boxes. I'm going to start from the inside to the outside. The size of the paper is getting bigger as follow. I have 10, 13, 15, and 17 centimeters. Next, we are going to spice things up a bit. I'm going to cut what I've marked with the scissor right here. One, two, three. For the fourth one, we are going to make it like this. Don't cut this part, but Make a light diagonal cut so you can hide them inside. I'm also gonna cut some sharp edges to make it like a heart shape as well. Before putting all of them together, I plan to make a small door here so I'm gonna cut the paper into a door shape on the fourth piece. Make sure you spare space for the lid of the box as well. And right here, I'm gonna place a plastic to resemble a window glasses. Before we put every layers together, as you can see, it's a bit dull here. So this is where my messy part begins. And if you don't like it, just use two sided of paper and that would be way easier than what I've planned. And last one, stick them together. And now we are going to make a lid. The size should be equal to the fourth pieces or the outside one, but um, there are gonna be an extra five millimeter of the sides that you should add in. And I am going to cut it like this. so that you can hide these pieces inside 
and form the lid. The last one here is a decorative part. Let's talk about the inside first. You can start placing anything you prepare inside. And I decided to make a Christmas tree, which I have already taught you guys in this two video. It could be any version that you like. Please check it out. And messages in um, several one different shapes or whatever. Picture on the paper, sweets, and some random box like this. And whatever you like to put it in, some good memories, something that make you smile. The picture when um, your loved ones see and they laugh. For the outside, there are four things I did. The brick walls, which I cut a cardboard into a rectangle shape and place it one by one, coloring with acrylics. Next, I make a roof with a corrugated paper by cutting two small pieces and start placing them one by one. Then I add a fake snow. I mix glue and white acrylic together to create a dense layers. Gently place it on the roof. Lastly, the wreath made from raw painted and the instant ribbon. guys might wonder who the fuck I'm writing to. They are those kids. Of course, they are dolls, toys, and memory from the old days, and you may think I'm crazy. But don't you dare lie to me, you haven't had one in your life. Have you tried thanking them? The one who dries a tear being smashed into some pillow to slow down your anger, or perhaps just sitting, being cute but silly at the same time and make you laugh. I couldn't have passed 2023 without them, so now if you have one, do it. And that's it for today, see you again someday, Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Thank you so so much for anyone who support me. Bye!